Here's the Elliott Wave forecast from March 16, 2009. For the Dow, it looks like Wave 1, Wave 2, Wave 3, Wave 4. If it's, a wa if it's four waves down, we find resistance right where it is and drop into fifth wave down. But the best case scenario is that it closes above uh, 7,700. If, if you can close above 7,700, it's a shot of taking out 8450. From the NASDAQ. Excuse me. For the NASDAQ, this could be wave one, wave two, wave three, wave four. If it's if it's four waves down, it would find resistance right where it is and drop into fifth wave down this week. But the best case scenario is it closes above 1470. If you can close above 1470, there's a shot of taking out 1600. The S&P could be wave one, wave two, wave three, wave four. If it's four waves down, it would find resistance right where it is, and the hammer it formed last Friday and drop into fifth wave down. Best case scenario is it closes above eight eight hundred. If you can close above eight hundred, there's a shot at taking out eight seventy five. That's a wrap.